here in Marion, Illinois to visit the last steam-powered short line in the U.S. Sitting alongside the engine house of the Crab Orchard and Egyptian is the railroad's first steam locomotive, 1946 Porter Built 242, number 5. Following the end of Class 1 steam, a number of short lines gained fame as they continued to operate steam. Despite still operating steam in 1985, the C.O.N.D. is not one of those lines. The Crab Orchard and Egyptian began as a tourist line in 1973, hauling passengers with number 5, which was then a saddle tanker. The 5 was rebuilt as a conventional tender engine the following year, and continued hauling passengers into 1978. In 1977, the railroad took over freight operations from the Illinois Central Gulf, which had wanted to abandon the line upon which the C.O.N.D. had been a tenant since its inception. The railroad discontinued its tourist trains following the 1978 season, and from that point on was the only steam-powered common carrier in the U.S. Number 5 was retired in mid-1979, replaced by Canadian-built 280 number 17. The train stops briefly, while the brakeman closes the gate at the Union Pacific Diamond before the train continues west. With empty spotted and loads tied to the tender, number 17 heads back downtown. With work done at P&S Grain, we climb back in the cab for the run to the west end of the line at Ordill. Number 17 crosses the UP at Marion. A little over six months later, she would be replaced by diesels after suffering a mechanical failure. A quarter century after the end of mainline steam, 
the steam era would in fact be over.